We need to talk to Anders, which we'll do later. Um. Let's see here. Let's stop by our house quickly. We'll drop off that shield. And see if there's anything else I want to drop off that I don't need. So, this is where you live. Not bad. I preferred the old place. It had, uh, more charm. You're talking about the shack I shared with my mother, uncle, and sister. I meant Lowtown. Dirty, chaotic... Glorious low town. The smell of tar and the sea and the sound of some whore plying her trade in a back alley. Don't you miss that? You can get your thrills in high town if you know where to look. Oh. And where would that be? I can show you what I have in mind. should go. I wouldn't want to take advantage of your hospitality. I like it when you take advantage of my hospitality. It was fun, wasn't it? Well, you know, if you ever want to do it again... Wait. You're not thinking of bringing feelings into this, are you? What about love? Love's not for everyone. It's not for me. It's just... messy. It's not always up to you. Love can be... pretty persistent. I don't care. It can go pester someone else. Did you know I was once married? When I was freed, I swore I would never marry again. I know you don't want to be tied down. And I would never do that to you. Good. I... appreciate it. Now, if you're done trying to confuse the issue, I'm going to go. I kind of expected that, but not, uh... <laughs> I wasn't 100% sure. Anyway, now that we have that romance done, uh, Isabella has a new costume. You kind of could see it earlier. Um, unfortunately, it is a little glitchy. It does like, have a habit of uh, disappearing and reappearing sometimes. So, we'll see it eventually. Put that away. Okay. Yeah, let's get out of here. Yep, still a little glitched. Alright, well. Alright, wind defense, self generous, all that fun stuff. Off to Sunder Mount. Ambushed, adventure slavers have finally caught up with Fenris. Ah, fuck you. Ah, these fucking slavers, they just don't know when to give up. Hunters. Stop right there! You are in possession of stolen property! Back away from the slave now and you'll be spared! Fenris is a free man! I won't repeat myself! 
Back away from the slave now! I am not your slave! Oh, they're dicks. There we go. Man, I forgot how powerful my uh, rope can be. More? More. Hiya! Backflip. Stunning. Right, switch to our archery real quickly. Yeah, it's in general better. Or stronger, I should say. I'll keep the air bone arrow out for a little bit. Damn ground. I don't know. I don't know, I swear. Adriana brought us. She's at the holding caves north of the city. I can show you the way. No need. I know which ones you speak of. Then let me go. I beg you. I swear you chose I won't... the wrong master. <laughs> Adriana. I was a fool to think I was free. They'll never let me be. Then why are we standing around? The holding caves held slaves in the old times, but apparently they are no longer abandoned. We must go quickly, before Hadriana has a chance to prepare, or flee. Well, damn. Anything else? Oh, let's loot these guys. There we go. <laughs> now, the bear pill is kind of, sort of, uh, timed. There will be a point where we will be attacked by, uh, a group of people. Basically, if we keep, uh, zooming around, eventually we'll be attacked by someone. And Fenders will be pissed at us, so we have to make sure we get that. Let's finish off Bitter Pill. Might as well. This thing's a bit easier on us. Alright, can't go that way. Embryum. Some goodness me grabs later on. Fuck all of you. Snap them off. Ah, I love archery. <laughs> no, buddy. What you got, buddy? Afraid? Yeah. Not really all that great, but oh well. Now, uh, this area is a little glitched. It's one of the few areas that actually stays after you finish the quest. So if you do miss stuff, you can come back here and get them. Oh, you know. 
Ah, uh, the mage, he teleported somewhere. Nope. Fuck all of you. It's messed up to be killed by a archer with their dagger. <laughs> Take all that. We'll have in the complex oh. chest. Commissioned Enchanter's Staff. Ooh. Fancy. It looks so cool down there. I've never been down there and I really want to. Alright, what's down over here? It's the Glare Dust! That is the last item for this area. Yay! Well, the last resource material. We still have a lot of items inside the, the actual holding cells. That should do it. Loot. All that. Now we go in. We must be careful. There were many such holdings once, especially in the mountains where individual slavers kept private pens. They were designed to protect against raids by fellow slavers. No doubt it's why Hadriana chose this place. Maybe she wanted to redecorate, add a few flowers. She's not a flowers kind of woman. Let's hope this isn't a waste of time. He's open. There we are. There's actually quite a few things down here. A uh, gift for Anders, and a few upgrades. Thank you, I was kind of worried about that. Alright. Uh, Meryl. Come on. Ah, those screens. There we go. And... Let's see. Sorry. Oh, there's um, Isabella's costume. Let's add Avalon as well. Can I give her the shield yet? Or is she only able to equip it? Yeah, she only able to equip it. Why is that? Strength! 34. What's her strength at right now? Ah, two more points. Alrighty. God damn here. Okay. See for yourself. The legacy of the Magistus. They sacrificed the unwilling. Is that so hard to believe? You're only a step away from it yourself. That's not true. Believe what you like. In my experience, mages always find a way to justify their need for power. Ah, uh, Fedoris, you have you have a lot to learn. I'll deal with this. Go down! And fight on the run. Aw. It took too long for the uh for me to knock the arrow. Oh well. Thanks, Fenris. Ah, of course, it's fun. I hate the whole they don't die until the animation's finished thing. I hope, I hope they fix that in Inquisition. And rain down arrows. Okay. One of Loot. Knock, knock. Hiya. <laughs> made him explode. Anything else? Yep. Backflip. And then the mage. He's not going anywhere. Thank you, Meryl. 
loot his dead corpse. Superior leather armor. Hmm. Open. <laughs> I want to just pop. You're great. We good? We good. Nope, nope, not good yet. Now we are. Are you hurt? Did they touch you? They've been killing everyone. They cut Papa, bled him. Why? Why would they do this? These poor people. This is ghastly. The Magister. She said she needed power, that someone was coming to kill her. We tried to be good. We did everything we were told. She loved Papa's soup. I don't understand. This has been terrible for you. Everything was fine until today. It wasn't. You just didn't know any better. Are you my master now? No. But I can cook. I can clean. What else will I do? If you go to Kirkwall, I can help you. Yes? Oh, praise the Maker. Thank you. I didn't realize you were in the market for a slave. I gave her a job, Fenris. Ah, then... that's good. My apologies. Let's find Hadriana and be done with this place. He's really gotta stop looking for the worst in people. And get that ginormous stick out of his ass. I actually have a uh, questioning belief for Fenris. Awesome. Uh, the questioning belief quest line is oh, got that. Um, the quest right before usually when you can romance them. Usually being the apt word. How is my? That's oh, getting there. You need to be about I believe seventy five percent on either side though before it happens. I believe that's the case. I'm not hundred percent sure though. So don't quote me on that. How about you? Hi. Nope. Fire. I love how you can still use your dagger even if you uh, are an archer. Now. We teleported. Where'd he go? Over there. It's a shame you can't use any of your dagger skills while you're, yeah, using your your archery. Although it is understandable, why not? Take all that. And in here we should have something for Fenris. Yep, reinforced straps. That is all of the upgrades you'll get for this chapter. Right? You should only have one more. I'll be easier if I check the inventory instead. Yep. Avely needs uh, one more, which I have yet to get. And Meryl needs two more, which again I've yet to get, but we will be getting soon. Right? Yeah. Just need to check to make sure. And there's her shield. Gotta hit that shield, so annoying. Nope, you're not going anywhere, bitch. Oh, she is. Shield, and then there's her army of Gunda. No, no, army of slavers. Oh, great, now she's using that uh, ice bomb. I really want to learn that spell, it's so cool. Oh, 
There she is. Thank you, Fenris. Oh, Meryl's dead. Fuck. Ow, motherfucker. That's all I'm here. She's teleporting again. Oh, hell no, hell no, hell no! Thank you. Stop! You do not want me dead! There is only one person I want dead more. I have information, Elf. And I will trade it in return for my life. Ha! <laughs> the location of Daenerys. What good will that do me? I'd rather he lose his pet pupil. You have a sister. She is alive. You wish to reclaim your life? Let me go, and I will tell you where she is. This is your call. So I have your word. I tell you, and you let me go. Yes, you have my word. Her name is Ravia. She is in Carinus, serving a magister by the name of Eremon. A servant, not a slave. She's not a slave. I believe you. <gasps> we are done here. Do you want to talk about it? No, I don't want to talk about it. This could be a trap. Daenerys could have sent Hadriana here to tell me about this sister. Even if he didn't, trying to find her would still be suicide. Daenerys has to know about her and has to know that Hadriana knows. But all that matters is I finally got to crush this bitch's heart. May she rot and all the other mages with her. Maybe we should leave. Don't comfort me. You saw what was done here. There's always going to be some reason, some excuse why mages need to do this. Even if I found my sister, who knows what the Magisters have done to her? What has magic touched that it doesn't spoil? I... need to go. That would've been a little more interesting if I was a mage, you know? Alright. Entry kit. Fix that. Anything else here? Nope. Okay, let's leave. No, I don't want to go to the bone pit. <laughs> Fuck. We're going back to the uh, house. Uh, the Fenris, so we can uh, finish the bitter pill quest and I believe do questioning beliefs. And so I can add a third person to my party so we can go to Sundermount. I kind of need a third person there. Just, just, just a little bit. Alright. Oh, we're stopping at my house. Okay. I've been thinking about what happened with Hadriana. I took out my anger on you, undeservedly so. I was not myself. I'm sorry. People take their frustrations out on me all the time. You are generous. When I was still a slave, Hadriana was a torment. She would ridicule me, deny my meals, pound my sleep. Because of her status, I was powerless to respond, and she knew it. The thought of her slipping out of my grasp now. I couldn't let her go. I wanted to, but I couldn't. I'm glad you killed her then. I should be happy now that Hadriana is dead. Instead, I feel nothing but... disquiet. This hate. I 
thought I'd gotten away from it. But it dogs me no matter where I go. To feel it again. To know it was they who planted it inside me. It was too much to bear. Ah, but I didn't come here to burden you further. We're friends, Fenris. I'm not certain I know what that is. Damn, that actually got him quite a bit happier. Pass Anubis, what are you doing? She claims she was sent here by you. I, uh, huh? I didn't know what to tell her. If you need any... Boom! Ah, there he goes again. How he makes these things, I'll never know. Perhaps you'll be the first dwarven mage. <laughs> Wouldn't that be interesting? I don't know. The actual mages don't do enchanting, do they? Just the ones who had their magic taken away. Tranquil. Yes, them. <sighs> I'm kind of curious how Sandal's able to do that. Like, I know dwarves aren't able to uh, cast cast magic, so it's kind of interesting. Saw that. Hello. Greetings, mistress. Your home was difficult to find. I've never been out on my own before, but I found it. Many people know of you. I hope I've made myself useful. I've already begun cleaning and I can cook. Not as good as Papa, but a little. Is there anything else you'd like me to do? If you're staying here, Orana. It will be as my servant. You mean... I won't be a slave anymore? You'll be paid. Like anyone else. I... A slave is all I've ever been. Like Papa and Grandpapa before me. I'll try to be a good servant. Thank you, Mistress. You're too good to me. Yeah, Nexus went like a, uh, a slave. Alrighty then. Let's add some people to our party and head over to, uh, do Meryl's quest. Meryl, Isabella, not Varric. A friend of mine, uh, Sody from the Minecraft Let's Play, mentions that she brings uh, Varric along with her in every quest that he's available in. Because, since he is technically telling the story um, after the fact and everything, it makes sense that he was there the entire time. So I think I'm going to start doing that as well, having Fen uh, Fenris. Varric and my party at all times as well. <clears throat> Plus, he has some pretty interesting uh, dialogue options, too. So, yay! And back here. Hello. Last bottle of the Egregio. I've been saving it for a special occasion. And what's that? The anniversary of my escape. Astia Valor Fermundis. Care to hear the story? I enjoy listening to you talk. <laughs> there are few pleasures greater than speaking with a beautiful woman. Let's see. You've heard of Saharan? The Imperium and the Kunari have fought over the island for centuries now. I was there with Denarius during a Kunari attack. I managed to get him to a ship, but there was no room for a slave. I was left behind. I barely got out of the city alive. There's nothing like war for covering one's escape. I had no intention of escaping. That time. There are rebels in the Saharan jungles called Fog Warriors. They found me and took me in nursed me back to health. I stayed with them for a time, until Daenerys finally came for me. He was relieved to see you'd survived, right? 
Relieved to see his investment hadn't ended up in Kunari hands, perhaps. I'd grown fond of the rebels. They bowed to no master and fought for their freedom. It was beyond my experience. When Daenerys came, they refused to let him take me. He ordered me to kill them. So I did. I killed them all. Once a slave, always a slave. It felt inevitable. My master had returned and this, this fantasy life was over. But once it was done, I looked down at their bodies. I felt... I couldn't. I ran and never looked back. This can't be easy to talk about. I've never spoken about what happened to anyone. I've never wanted to. Perhaps this is what it means to have a friend. Might want to take it easy on that bottle. <laughs> it's the last one, I swear. To you, Hawk. May I fight at your side for years to come. Ah. Any sweetish. Oh well. Alright, let's get out of here. Let's see here. We need to go talk to Meryl at some point. Let's sell some of the stuff we don't need. I've gotten one of the herbalist tasks, didn't I? Done? Oh, no, I know how to find out real quickly. Just need to go check the uh, maps. Alright. Keeping that. Don't need that. Keep, keep. Hmm. Felon's punch. Felon's punch gut. Uh, punch gut. Interesting. Hmm. Nah, Hood's message to the king is pretty much better. No, 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 no. No, no, no. No. Anything worthwhile? Not particularly. Oh, I'm gonna buy some of these. I'll just stock up on these potions. I pretty much spent all my money earlier. That's all the money I gained so far. Alright, my recorder is starting to act up, so I'll be right back while I reset it. I'll be right back. <laughs> 